You know what's really funny? If anyone ever, like, brushes near your hand or your entire body or just anything, like, they even, like, sort of, like, tap into you, like, just turn around and scream at them, Did you just grab my ass? Funniest thing ever, trust me. Hey, how's it going everyone? It's Ryan Paneki here. We're doing part four of Crash Bandicoot. That's right, part four of Crash Bandicoot. We're in Sunset Vista, and uh, wow, I almost fell off the ledge there right at the very beginning. Not sure how this part's gonna play out, because the game is getting um, uh, harder, obviously, and I believe this stage is a little bit long. This is a key stage, I believe, so there are some Neocortex icons lying around, and that'll get us a key, and... I don't remember where they are, so we'll try and get them, obviously. I mean, why not? But uh, I can't make any promises on that front. Got this lizard dude. I'm going to wait till he gets to the middle platform, and boom, he's gone. Bye-bye, iguana guy. I had a pet iguana growing up, and he was an asshole. And the reason why he was an asshole is because whenever you'd feed him or anything, he would kick you into the water, and then after he kicked you into the water, um... Uh, he was just really, he was just a dick, like, you try to feed him and he just bite you and shit. And he loved our curtains, like, he just loved being on curtains, like, that was just his thing. So he'd climb all over the place and sometimes he would somehow get out of the cage, I don't know how, it's, it's beyond me, but whenever he did get out of the cage, we'd be like, oh, we'll just check the curtains and then boom, there he is just, like, chilling, just loitering on our curtains for some unforeseen reason. Uh, maybe that's just a thing, maybe they just like curtains or something, maybe that's, I don't know. I mean, the curtains were near the window, maybe, you know, hot during the summer, they, they, love, they like their heat. They like to bathe, as they, as they say, sunbathe. Don't reptiles love doing that? I believe they do. I want to take this uh, strategically here, there we go, he's gone. Wait for that guy to, there he's gone. Wait for these baddies to fly by, because I hate them with a fiery passion. And here we go. Not too bad to start off. Don't want to jinx it, obviously. Ooh, we'll need these. I'm pretty. I'm looking pretty good on lives here. I uh, went back and stocked up on some. Just hunting some of those Woompa fruits. And uh, yes, people called me out on that because I was calling them apples. What's funny is you don't realize that in part one and two, I called them Woompa fruits uh, multiple times. Uh, I don't know. Sometimes I just swap the names. I mean, they're obviously apples, but you know, just swap the names. Woompa fruit. Blah blah. blah. You know, you, 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 you guys, you, you buddies out there calling me out on it. That's all right. I love the, the passion you guys have. Oh, there's an Aku Aku, by the way. That's why I came back here. And now he's got, uh, he can take two hits. And that's great news because we'll need that. But considering ha more than half my deaths are just simply falling off the stage, he doesn't really help you in that, in that manner. And I wish he could. I wish he'd, like, bounce you back out. And then he takes a hit that way. But unfortunately, that's not how that works. Ugh. Betty's. Oh no! Off the ledge. Ah, see, yep. Now I lost him. That sucks. Could have took a hit with that guy. Ah, oh, I feel really bad that I got rid of him now. Why is this all awkward now? Why is the fire and Betty's not matching up anymore? Ah, 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 ah. There we go. Wow, that did not match up well. Shit. Ah, get out of here. Thank you. Ooh. And wait for all three of them. There we go. I got, I'm gonna be honest, feeling really nervous for this part. This is a really, this is, I know this is a big level. I know it is. We're not even at the first Tauna or the first Neo Cortex. But there's, there's somewhere in here. I just don't know where. Oh, okay, that platform falls. Don't remember you doing that, Jim. Why would you do that? Jim's always trying, oh, I gotta watch out too. Like, you always look at the fire and you're just like, ooh, decoration for the level, but it's like, you know, <laughs> they're there because if you fall on it, like, you're, you're dead. You're, you're charred up, you're burnt up, you're burned as shit. You get not just third degree burns, but I'd say fourth degree to the point where you're uh, pretty much ash and, uh, is that what you consider it? Ash Ketchum? No, no, oh, no, not ash. Ketchum, like, like straight up ash, you know, like cremation. Okay. There we go. I got worried there for a second. No! Well, at least I demonstrated to you that that's the kind of ash that you, you would turn into. Not ash catching, by the way. Uh, you know what's uh, really, uh, like, one thing I've always disliked about, and I, I obviously you guys know I'm a huge Pokemon fan, but 
you know, they've, there's a real missed opportunity with the cartoon, you know, because obviously it's geared towards children and it's a completely cartoon sort of esque sort of thing. But I want like a full on like manga serious Pokemon TV show, you know, like anime. Damn it, same thing happened to me twice. Um, that'd be awesome. Unless there, unless one like that exists, but I don't. I'm pretty sure that doesn't exist. Obviously, I'm very certain that doesn't exist. There's comics, I know that. But uh, you know. Not like a full-on anime TV show. I would have totally watched that. It was like serious. There's like, you know, like a romance sort of situation. There's swearing. There's like, you know, blood possibly. And like real, just, you know, realness. The real kind of stuff. Oh, really? Three times? Wow. The kind of real stuff that comes with anime, you know? Kind of that real, you know, that's just that anime feel. And I haven't watched animes in years. For some reason, a lot of people ask me if I watch, if I'm, if I'm an anime fan, if I watch anime. I used to be. I really just don't watch it that much anymore. I don't know. Kind of fell out of it. But my favorite anime is Fooly Cooly. Which sucks because I love it, but it sucks because it's only had... Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No. Wow. Number four. Wow. Well, we are on a roll. It sucks because Fooly Cooly was only, only had like four episodes. Or six. It had six episodes for the whole series. Like, that's it. But I do have the manga for that as well. Those are always fun reads. Ah, uh, why am I taking so long? I kind of stalled for a second. Don't know why I got nervous. Kind of like that talking to your crush nervous. You just sort of go, uh, uh. Okay, stay, 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 stay. There we go. Hey, the first Tana. That's somewhat relieving. It means we're making progress. We'll probably get to Koala Kong if I don't spend too much time on this level. Obviously, I don't want to keep my lives up, you know, a little bit. I don't want to have to backtrack and build up the lives again, but I probably will have to, because, you know, you know me. Whew, okay, there we go. Thank God to get to a checkpoint. Feels good. I'm totally missing my opportunity <laughs> to jump, by the way. Uh, my, my hands are so sweaty, and I don't know why. Ooh, okay, okay, wow. <sighs> I really did not think I was going to make that jump. Okay, there we go. Mm. Oh, ah! oh, okay, okay. Okay, well, I, I, I did die. All right, I'm, I'm all right with it. I'm quite all right with it. Because, you know, what? I'm going into this with confidence. That's what I always tell people. Whatever situation you may have that may, that may, may, may be bothering you or what have you, you know, you always go into it with confidence. You know, tell yourself that you can do it. Because you're more than capable of doing whatever it may be. Even if it's, even if it's you know, you want to, uh, you know, lift a car over your head. You can do it. Not really. That's pretty impossible. I don't think I know anyone that can do that. Why, is it, why do the bats got to be right here? Like, really? I don't remember you guys being there. Oh, shit. <laughs> wow. That was something. I will tell you that right now. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's getting to me. The pressure's getting to me. Okay, why am I not making that jump? Okay, there we go. We're on it. <laughs> Somebody hold my hand. It's been so long since I've played so all these difficult levels. Oh, there we go. Ooh, how do you open that? Ooh, this. Oh, I can't get up there. Unless... Oh, I don't want to risk it, though. I really don't. Oh, him. Okay. Sweet. There we go. I believe our first Neocortex is in here. I don't want to break the boxes. There he is. Yep. Don't know where the other two are. But if I spot it, I think I'll... It'll come to me. Oh, shit. Where's the bats? Where's the bats? Fire, 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 fire. You come and go. You come and go. 
What year is that from? Is that in the 80s or the 90s? Ooh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. I want those. Um, okay, find the distance so I'm safe. And then get ready for this. Ready? We're going to count to three. One, two. I'm doing it now. Ah, oh, I messed up. Ah, uh, I'm screwed. See, I probably should have gone on three, you know? Oh, box, come back. Oh, behave. I, I definitely think you can't just jump to those. No, you cannot. Well, that's all right. Like I said, obviously I'm not doing a... Oh, shit. Fuck my face. Well, we got another shot at it. Hey, come over here. Do you still keep the uh, icons if you've... Uh, I, that I don't remember. Let's check. Yeah, we still have them. Ooh, I got a life. Nice. I'll take them. Get out of here. God, bats are so creepy, man. I've never seen a bat in real life. But I'd have to imagine it looks fairly uh, creepy. It's like, a, it's like a naked mole rat that just flies and just yells at you. Because that's what they do right when they see you. They just go... It's like, stop yelling at me. I didn't do anything. Ah, oh, I messed it up again. I really tried to go for it that time, too. I gotta wait for the right moment here. Because I'm not really understanding its pattern completely right now. Shit, well that's not the right pattern. Come on. At least this gives me good opportunity to keep... Piling up the Woomper fruits. Sorry, I said apples. And, uh... Um, what you call it? Lives and whatnot. And, uh, or, or no, and, uh, more opportunities to try and get that other Neocortex. Well, now I'm just being silly. Because now I'm not even waiting for the proper moments that I could do right before. Because that always happens in games, you know keep retrying and then you start failing earlier and earlier 64 I can't count that high and believe me I've tried like I want to count that high but I can't do it I get to like I get to like three one two sixty and then I'm like oh what's this <laughs> fire burn bad Come on, bats. Do, 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 do. How's everybody been? Been good? Did you have a good weekend? Huh? Kind of went short on that one. I've been having a good weekend. Oh, I messed it up again. I wasn't even... I was trying to go step away from the one box. I knew I wasn't going to make it that time. But I accidentally fell in the first box. How does this go? Let me look at this for a second. Like, Let me, let me really analyze this. Okay, that... That's what'll do me, so don't do that. So, go, no, no, no. Yeah, that's not the way to do it, so then... Okay, so, alright. There we go. Now let's look at this one. Welp, I think I cracked the case. There we go. Oh, oh my god. Oh god, jeez. Good lord. Whew. Oh, a second Tana. That's good. At least we can get a Tana and maybe try and get bank, uh, bank some extra lives. Wow, we are half... Oh, we are 15 minutes in, aren't we? And we're still not done with this level. Holy crap, man. This is a long one. I mean, it's long, obviously, because I'm taking so well long on it. But, you know. Ooh. Oh, don't let that box fall on me. Uh, what are we doing here? There we go. I think I think it's safe to say this is one of our best parts. I'm handling this pretty well. I think it's uh, it, I'm finally adjusting to using the D-pad again too. Ah, oh, I jumped way too far off. 
that's good. It's all coming back to me. Those PS1 days, pre DualShock days. Those were the days, man. Whew, got nervous on that one. Ooh, there's a box over there. I believe that might have a Neo Cortex. But we didn't get the second one, so screw it. No point in going after it if we're not going to be able to go in there. Hey, we got our Tana! Yay! Celebrate good times, Ryan! Crook, 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 crash, bandicoot, ooh, ooh, yeah! I know there's an extra life in here. There it is. Hey, baby. I like your sneakers, yo. I like your up do. Um, yeah, of course I'd love to save it. Of course I'd love to overwrite it. You know, if you were to overwrite something on a piece of paper, it'd just start looking like scribbles. You know, if I, like, if I draw a picture of an octopus and you draw, like, a couple letters over it, it's just gonna look like a bunch of gobbledygook. You know, that's one of my odd talents. I can't say I can do much in life. I can't say I'm necessarily useful for anything, but if you ever need me to uh, draw an octopus, I can easily do it in about a minute. On any on any surface, oh Jesus Lord! Uh, on any surface with any sort of viable writing utensil, I can whip one up pretty fast. And it look it looks pretty authentic. Like you look at it and you're like, yeah, that's definitely an octopus, you know. And I used to be an artist. I I used to be like a little artist growing up, you know, like in, in elementary and middle school and all that. And people would be like, oh Ryan's doing all this great work and stuff. And but my talents never like increased like going into like high school and you know college and all that. So I kind of just stayed where I was, so I was advanced to begin with, and then I just kind of, like, didn't go any further. And then it got to the point where I, I don't know, I just, I never stopped, kept drawing anymore. But I like drawing. I like coloring every so often, doodling and whatnot. I do, I, I did like art. I was a little doodle bug. Is there anything over here? No. I don't think I can get over there. There's obviously no v visible crates or anything as far as I can see. So we're, we're moving on. Oh, this guy. Look out. Hold the phone. Ooh. And you know, in art class, it was always like I draw something, and they're like, "Oh, we're putting this in the art show." And the art show was just like something that like barely any parents showed up and whatnot. <laughs> and I ne I never went to them or anything. I never did any I didn't I never did any extracurricular activities when I was in school. Like never. Qualcomm, that's great news. Qualcomm's pretty simple from what I remember. He just throws boulders at you, and you really don't get much movement area as far as. Yes. Yeah, you just get this like little walkway and you really can't do nothing. You just gotta like keep Well, I already got hit, so Yeah, you just like Yeah, I never got this part. I was like I was like, why is this such an underwhelming battle? Even though I I'm already down to my last life or what I, what have you, but Just wanna make sure I can do this because Qualcomm does take four hits, so. And I'm down. That's fine. Ooh, I get him maxed out Aku Aku again. That's I'll take that. Let's go, Qualcomm-y. Mr. Steroid. You can look at him, that dude is fucking jacked. Like that is the kind of dude that pumps iron at least 23 hours a day. And he gets all, he, and he like buys like jars of protein and just inhales it, you know? Ooh. I was never the best with coordination and timing, so I feel like I could mess this up at any moment. Oh, I didn't get him because the thing was in the way. Ow. Yep, just weasel your way over here. I'll follow you. Don't worry. There we go. Two more. I really wish it was one more, because the whole part was pretty much that one level. Oh, it's a it's a heavy one. Aw, uh, why you gotta have a TNT right there? Boosh. One more time. 
gonna sell. Oh, okay. Now I gotta be real. Oh, the TNT landed on me. We're gonna sell. Oh, yeah. Did he shake his ass at me? Did he just do that? You know what's really funny? If anyone ever, like, brushes near your hand or your entire body or just anything, like, they even, like, sort of, like, tap into you, like, just turn around and scream at them, Did you just grab my ass? Funniest thing ever, trust me. That is from, uh, uh, Night at the Roxbury. Never seen that movie. Uh, Mr. Zadul, I believe? And the whole movie, like, <laughs> the guy just had an obsession with ass. And whenever you touched, whenever someone, he was just obsessed with, like, ass touching. Ow. And he had this, like, assistant named Dewey. And he'd just be like, Dewey, did you just grab my ass? And it would always be in situations where he definitely didn't grab his ass. Like, one time Dewey entered a boardroom, and then Mr. Zadir was like, Did you just grab my ass, Dewey? And he's like, Sir, from where I'm standing, that's a physical impossibility. It was a funny moment. Okay, I'm having some difficulties here. I'm getting close, but it's just the timing. And it's, it's kind of hard to tell, you know? Like, because there's just no frame of distance in PS1, you know? You can't, like, tell that. You know? Like, sometimes you just can't see how close things are to you. See, like, right there. Boy, it'd be really depressing if I, uh, <laughs> lost all my lives on Koala Kong, huh? But, you know, I would be the person to do it, so... Ooh, don't fall into the lava. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Excuse me again, I drank a lot of Pepsi. Oh, damn it, that's the one where I'm supposed to head back. Okay, this is the one. I'm gonna promise you guys this, this is the one. Stop shaking your booty at me. This is it. Ready? Ready? I'm gonna be all serious. No, no ass talk or, or nothing. No, but seriously, do that next time. Like, I I mean, if you're obviously not comfortable with doing it to strangers, like, just do it to, like, <laughs> just do it to your friends or something. They just, like, brush up on you when you're walking or something. Hey, just grab my ass. And they'll be like, what? No, of course not. And then just go, it's okay if you did. I understand. Mr. Zadir. It's Zadir or Zadul? Don't remember. Come on, Mr. Koali Kongy. Don't be upset because, like, pretty much no one loves you at all. Oh, I, I hit him right in the ass. No one wants giant boulders up their ass. That would really hurt. What happened? I know for a fact that TNT didn't get me because that's, that's where Dick. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, okay. Well, now I'm having some troubles here. So if need be, a cut of footage will be made until I finally freaking get the guy. But at this point, I think this is all the Let's Play will be filled with. One level and then Koala Kong. I thought we were going to get to the new island, which we will, obviously, if we beat them, but... Damn, I can't do that. I can't jump. Um, but I don't think we'll be able to play the first level there now. Because that level's also pretty long. Most of the levels are getting pretty long now. But, you know, if you're good at the game, you can obviously, like, you know, rush through it. Damn it, I really gotta stop doing that, because that's not working out in my favor. Come on, buddy. Make my day. Damn it. I, I'm, I think I, ha I, I, like, I have to straight up hit it back if the TNT's in the way, you know? Because I can't jump. I'm pretty much done. This is disappointing, because I really don't remember Qualcomm being this much of, a, of an issue. Ah, and I still took a hit. See, I, I swung, I uh, spun too early, as the kids would say. That's what kids say nowadays, right? They meet up in the hallway, and they're like, Becky, what'd you do last night? Oh, sweetie, I spun way too early. And I still jump, too. I'm telling myself I'm not going to do it, and I keep doing it. But spinning is like... That's like an exercise thing, so... It does work in some context. No, I'm not going to hit him. And I also died. Mr. 
Mr. Koala, bring me your rocks. I'll throw them back at you and it'll hurt. Mr. Koala Kong, bring me your dreams. Mr. Kong, throw me your boulder. I want your boulder all up in my face. Why are we fighting in this lava mine? You're not mine, I have my own Valentine. Her name is Coco 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 Coco. Oh no, Tana. Ta 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 Because we don't like incest. Oh, I took my first hit. Now I took my second in a matter of ten seconds. Bring me your dreams. I saw my green crystals on the background and the foreground. Bam! There we go. All I had to do was sing. And trust me, if you heard that, it wasn't that great. Uh, unfortunately, I'll probably put it in because what I'm saying right now, you'd have to know and contact and put it in context and everything. Yeah, you, you see what I'm saying. Look, everybody, uh, we're pretty much done now. Heavy machinery, so that'll be the next part. We're obviously getting close to the end of uh, Crash Bandicoot, and I think by the time the next part goes up, there will also be a GTA Online Let's Play part up. Hopefully, me and Brandon are gonna do some co-op, so check that out. Not really co-op. We'll just probably mess around or do whatever do some bank heist or what, what have you we're doing game we're doing gameplay we know you want it all right but i as i've said this before i'm not doing single player gameplay because i just enjoy the game on my own plus i already beat the game 100 <laughs> percent the single player 100 percent. i already did all of it so thank you for watching and i'll see you all in the next part and i love you